Let's have a look at the highlights of race 30 of the V8 Supercars Championship at the Armorall Gold Coast 600 and a 102 lap 300 kilometer race and there was plenty of action from the start. 27 cars on the grid and drama here, there and everywhere. The Norton Nissan and the Jack Daniels Nissan were getting stuck together. Taz Douglas and Carl Reinlup. Warren Luff led the way early on but Greg Murphy had contact with Paul Numbrell in the championship leading Jamie Winkup car. The Holden Racing Team Commodore was badly damaged at the beach chicane and he and James Courtney were done for the day. They were the first retirement from the race on lap 19. This was on board with Greg. Heavy damage. He limped it back to pit lane. But that HRT Commodore has seen better days. Car number one had dramas too. Dumbrell managed to get it to the lane, but then it stopped on the exit. No points for Jamie Winkup. The championship leader coming to the Gold Coast, he would slip down the leaderboard. How about this, though? Brotherly love? Not. Will Davison in the side of brother Alex. Nick Perkat climbed out of car number two for Garth Tander, but it wouldn't go. It would not refire. They eventually got it to fire and go, but he finished 18th and three laps down. Mark Winterbottom, passenger window came loose. It did blow out of the number five Ford, but he still had to come to pit lane for... The mechanical black flag, Fabian Coulthard, Lockwood Commodore crashing into that extra curb at the beach chicane, the damage ripping the right front out of the Lockwood Commodore. He would fail to finish with Luke Yulden as the FPR Ford managed to get on by. The Kiwi limped it back into the garage. Plenty of high flying for Todd Kelly in the Jack Daniels Nissan. He finished 17th with David Russell, but saving on the Dunlop tyres over the back chicane. Plenty of fighting back in the pack. Reynolds and Moffat on the fringe of the 10 playing dodgem cars as they raced up towards the chicane. And then the Nissan let go. Engine drama, DNF for James Moffat and Taz Douglas. Mark Winterbottom did everything but crash car number five. Under pressure for third place from Tony Delberto, who threw everything at his first V8 supercar podium. His co-driver Johnny Reed watching on. But they couldn't stop Craig Lowndes and Warren Luff from winning race 30. And Lowndes sweeping into the V8 Supercar Championship lead. Shane Van Gisbergen and Jerome Bleekemolen second. Mark Winterbottom and Stephen Richards rounding out the podium.